Let's talk about palettes. Palettes are referenced data. This means that anytime data is stored in a palette, it can be referenced by a queue. Any changes that we make to a palette after the fact will be updated in all queues that use that palette moving forward and throughout our show. Palettes are divided into four categories, intensity, color, focus, and beam. Each of these categories can only contain that specific information. For example, a color palette cannot contain focus information. Let's look at an example of an intensity palette. We'll start with a clear stage, so I'm gonna clear sneak enter. And I'm gonna turn on a lot of lights. I'm gonna turn on one through 135 to full. I'm gonna record this as intensity palette one. Record, intensity palette one. And I'm gonna give this a label of 100%. Let's clear sneak enter again. Now I'll put group 20 at 10 through 100. Enter, get a nice gradient on our psych there. And let's record that group 20, record as intensity palette two. And I'm gonna label that hot psych center. Clear sneak enter again. And now let's look at group 20 in intensity palette one, the one we created first. And you'll see those channels went to full. If I hold down my data button, I can see that level there. You'll notice it says IP1, which is short for intensity palette one on my tiles. If I want to see the label instead of the palette number with my gear icon, I can enable references here. And note that that 100% is the label from the palette that's not intensity data. Again, if I hold my data button, it will show me full behind it there. 